Hello everybody, it's Jim the Gentleman Crafter and I'm here with my uh, project for Graphic 45. Um, this is the lighthouse. It's a fun piece, I think. Um, it's a fairly large piece as well. It's about 24 inches, I would say. Um, I'm going to walk you through um, the, the different sections of it here. Um, I hope the lighting is good. So uh, the top part, let's start with the top. Um, the top portion uh, for the light, I made it into a little octagonal box. Um, so that you could uh, put a tea light inside. Um, there's tea light on there and turn it on. And for the glass, I used um, acetate. Um, and what I did was I used a spouncher, I believe it's called. Um, it's this little sponge um, pouncing brush. And I used uh, glossy accents on it, which gave it kind of that uh, um, uh, opaque look to it, which, which you'll see uh, closer in the pictures later. Okay, so that's the top portion. Um, this is actually the lid to a mini that's in the body. And then the base, uh, the base is just has a drawer for storage right there. So um, I'll take off the top like that. This whole section comes off. And then the body comes out of the base like that, maybe move that out of the way. And then um, here is the little, uh, it's not really a mini, it's more a photo, photo album for, uh, for my vacation that I took this summer. So, and that's what that looks like. You'd open it up, octagon, and um, here are the little pages. This is a really cool um, technique, and I, you'll see it closer in the pictures that I, uh, was, uh, that I learned about at uh, the Carolina Stamper. Um, I, I believe it's Fred Mullet. Um, who does this, and he takes black um, cardstock and uh, puts bleach on his stamps and stamps it onto the paper, which is really, really kind of cool. He goes a little bit further, obviously, and he did a beautiful job. I just I just pant, uh, uh, stamped it on there just for the effect of the paper for a background border. So that is inside the book. And what I did here um, is a new technique for me. Uh, that I designed is uh, the skewers, the skewer binding. And basically what I've done is I've taken, uh, taken some chipboard and uh, doubled it up, uh, glued it to uh, two base pieces, taped it down on the backside, punched eight inch holes about every quarter inch, and um, inserted skewers into the base. And uh, it works, works really great. So I'm excited about doing a lot, a lot of, a lot of cool things with that uh, in the future. So um, that is my lighthouse. And once again, just a fun, fun little, uh, quick photo album for for pictures. So that fits back into the base like that. And I made the little rim, the little uh, one inch octagonal rim to hold it. And then once again, um, the, the base, I'll take the lid off and the, the tea light out. Once again, um, an opening here to set this onto. I made it a little bit wider so it would be easier to just place in there really quickly. And that is my lighthouse. I hope you enjoy it. Thanks a bunch.